we will now have a look at one of the control pellets that we're using to supervise the water quality. Two of the most important parameters is the, are the oxygen level and the water temperature. You can see them here on this display. The tests that we do over here are determined to find out things at a certain water temperature. So we control the water temperature and keep it very constant. And the same is true for the oxygen level, as this is crucial for the feed intake, the digestion process and the growth. So there should never be any deficiency of oxygen. So that is why we have a minimum oxygen concentration installed. And this is the panel where we can check. We already mentioned that it's very important to be on top of the water quality in a RAS facility. So regular water measurements are uh, very important. So this is one of the daily routines. You measure all the important parameters. And the one that we will talk about now is the ammonium concentration. The ammonia is the excretion product that the fish excretes into the water. The NH3 form of ammonium is actually toxic. So we measure the total ammonium concentration to get an idea if you're in the, in the green zone. So we prepared the sample. This is the water from the system without the chemicals. And this is the sample with the chemicals. And here we can measure the ammonium concentration. So we look at the different colors over here to see where we are. And it's quite clear that we're very low in ammonium. The ammonium concentration is actually below 0.5 milligram per liter. That's an excellent value. So the water quality, at least the ammonium concentration, is very low for the fish and the conditions are optimal in this respect. The oxygen level is one of the most important parameters in fish farming and especially in a RAS. You want to make sure that there's never a deficiency so that there's sufficient oxygen for the fish available all the time. We already saw that we have an automatic panel checking the oxygen level all the time. But still, if you have a tank with a lot of fish and a high feed rate, you may be willing to check the oxygen level in that particular tank. So that is why we use this handheld device with which we can control the oxygen level at that uh, time. We've put it in the water and you have to wait for the figure to become stable and then we can take a reading. At this moment it's about 88.3, 88.4% oxygen saturation and 8.002 milligrams per liter. For the amount of fish in this tank and a given temperature this is a very good oxygen level. So everything is fine. In a RAS it's crucial that uh, the pellets are very water stable because you want them to be in one piece when they reach the drum filter. This may take considerable time depending on the water flow in the system. So one important water quality check is to see how they behave in the water. And this is one of our RAS feeds, is the Crystal Aztecs. We've put it in the water a while ago, about one hour ago. And now we will have a look at uh, the pellets, if they're still whole, so not disintegrated and uh, if they also if they have not leached. So if you zoom in, for example, you can clearly see that the pellets are still there. They are not disintegrated. They're there in one piece. So even after one hour, the drum filter will see complete pellets that it can easily take out.